Avast ye viewers, Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, doing another Black Flag video. In this one, I have Kenway capture the final fort that I needed to capture. When you capture all the forts, you get a achievement called King of the Castle. And that's what this video is titled. And how you go about doing it is the way you want to go about doing it. This last fort I had just left aside. And when I decide to take it down, well, I captured the video and you can see how things went. The fort I had left off and now am going to capture is Cop. Cabo de Cruz, and it is a hard fort to take down. It's well defended, and what happens is a ship came to the defense of the fort, and I had to battle that ship, and the weather got a little rough. So I'm going to fast forward to the attack on the fort and let it play out a little bit. When you come to within about mortar distance of the fort, slow down the jackdaw to a somewhat high rate of speed, and you sort of walk the mortar in, and they're going to see you, and you fire the mortars, and you start doing damage to the fort. You got to do several fires and several passes using the heavy guns to take down the fort itself. Now, there's going to be a ship coming in, and the jackdaw is going to have to take care of that as well, but you want to use heavy guns as well and damage the fort as much as you can and take down as many defensive structures. Once you take all of the structures down, there's four of them, the fort falls apart, and anyone attacking you backs off. This is where two other ships decide to take interest, and it makes it a little difficult. You want to take the ships down first. In this case, this is a schooner, which I can sink relatively easy. And the ship, well, okay, I'm just firing at the fort, but... I can ram the ship and take it down, the smaller ship. Now this is a brig, which is that much more difficult to take down. And it's going to require a little strategy, because once I take down the brig, well, I kind of don't want to take the fort down quite yet, because I want to board the brig and capture the loot that is aboard the brig. So we're going to come in side by side and I'm going to fire guns if I can. I'm going to fire some chain shot here. Uh, yeah, it's getting to be a little hectic, but let's see if I can bring 
the jackdaw around and focus on the ship rather than the fort. I pulled the jackdaw out of mortar range of the fort. Now I'm going to go back and take down the fort using my mortars. And once the fort is taken down, I can board the other ship, take their cargo and possibly their crew, and get not only the booty, but the fort. Because once you take down a fort, you don't have to attack right away. You have plenty of time to take down the fort if necessary. And yes, there we go. The fort is crashing down. But first, take over and I'm going to jump on to the other boat and collect the reward for boarding and looting the boat. This ship happens to be a brig, so you have to kill um, 10 of the enemy crew. And usually I just fire the deck gun sort of at random. If you're going aboard a ship to attack and kill enemy crew, what you want to do is cutlasses and smoke bombs. You don't have to worry about doing anything else except kill 10 enemy crew. Okay, the ship is captured, and now the choice to be made. Do I want to lower the jackdaw level or repair it? I'm going, well, I got to repair it or send the ship to Kenway's fleet. I have no choice. It sucks. But in repairing the jackdaw, now I can kind of pay a harbor master or someone, bribe someone to uh, make my ship disappear. And it didn't list any cargo, which sucks. Now I'm going to bring the jackdaw to the fort and fight my way through the fort. As is with most forts, uh, you can't get to the dock, so Kenway has to swim a little bit and run up a path to get to the main gate. I could have used that lift, but no big deal. And now you got to find a place to climb, which is right next to this. Uh, you don't want to climb up the flaming part. And yeah, um, just run Kenway over. The doors are locked, so we run up here and have to kill the fort's two officers, which, again, smoke bombs and cutlasses. People are going to try and stop you. 
throw a smoke bomb, kill this officer, kill a few other guys, and then run around and find the final officer in which Kenway has to kill. Yeah, uh, Kenway had to run around a little bit in order to finally catch up to the officer. I'm going to take care of these two guys and the final officer, throw a smoke bomb, take him down. And now I have to reach the uh, fort commander, the war room, and you have to become anonymous in order to open up the door. So Kenway has to kill some people here. And there you have it. Now, things will spawn at the fort that will make it useful to Kenway. Um, there is a harbor master, an assassination uh, mission, and a guy who's a local government official who you can bribe if your wanted level is too high. Forts are a great place for you to sell off. Um, the cargo, you can't buy anything. You can buy upgrades to Jackdaw, and you can buy ammunition, but you can't improve Kenway. Then you can uh, bribe the harbor master if you have a high wanted level and reduce any chance of ships coming after you. Also, you can run around the fort looking for. Uh, certain uh, treasure chests and animus fragments, which are usually around the forts. You can gather them up. You can, every fort, you know, you don't have to do it, but I don't know if there's an achievement or anything, but extra treasure is always good. And that's what I'm having Kenley do. And opening forts up opens up the map where possible hidden missions become revealed. And that is always a good thing. If you like this video, hit the like button. Leave some comments. I always respond to comments. If you like this type of video, I post four a week and you don't want to miss out. So hit the subscribe button and then the bell icon and you will be notified. And my videos will be put up in your feed. I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. Thanks for stopping by.